There's nothing like chilling with my girls Just me and my divas taking over the world And Devos, and welcome back to Many Faces of Beauty with your girl April. Now, it's been a minute, and I finally took off my royalty um, human hair lace wig to wash it. And I said, you know what? I'm just going to do a new video because I'm long overdue. So this one is an affordable yet practical and very easy synthetic lace front, and it is by the R&B Collection. Name is Amber in the color 1B, and I got her right from eclassyfashion.com. Now, if I am correct, I do believe that they still are having their September sale where the lace wigs start at like $29 and so forth, and the human hair lace front start at like $34, $39. And I think that was for the whole month of September. So, if I am correct, and if I am wrong, then please forgive, but I do believe that that sale is still going on. So, make sure you check out eclassyfashion.com. And as well as if you live in Decatur, just make sure that you stop by, shout them out, check them out, see what they got going on. From a video I seen on YouTube from another young lady's trip to um, E Classy Fashion, it's in like a plaza. It's in like a plaza, like a shopping plaza. And it's a beauty supply store. I don't think the name of it is E Classy Fashion as on as in a walk-in store, but it's right in a shopping plaza and I'll put there their information below so that way if you live in the Decatur area, Georgia, Georgia area, you can just stop in. So, as for Amber, now I like um, the R&B collection because their wigs are really easy. They're really easy and they last a good amount of time as long as you know how to take care of them. Now this is the color 1B and sometimes I just try to stick to what I know best, like the color. Unless it's like a full lace, then I'll get something a little bit different. You know, but she's really easy. This is a good go to work style. You don't have to play with the curls a lot. You just put her on and go to work. You know, or run out the house, whatever you have to do. It's not straight, but it's got like a kind of loose body wave, loose body curl in her very loose body wave curl. And she's a just an average length. So she's not too long. She's not too, you know, over dramatic, too glamorous. She's perfect. You can wear her out, you can wear her to work, what, what have you, but she's really, really easy. So this is Amber, ladies. Really easy wig, really easy. And as far as parting, the um, R&B collection, they give a, a nice, decent amount of parting space. Take out the ruler, and I'm going to say it's like two inches right in the middle, I'm guessing. And I guess right, two inches. So two inches right in the middle, you have your combs right by the temples for each side in the front area then you have your adjustable strap and your comb in the back as well as your lace right here and theirs are not too thick in the front so they kind of thin out in the front for the R&B collection and it's just a normal wig weft tracks in the middle so check her out check her out she's a really easy style really easy comes with some tape what you really don't need and some wash and care instructions so I'm gonna cut the lace off real quick. all right ladies so I already put her on <clears throat> I didn't style her or anything like that but I just wanted to you know situate her so what I want to do is I just want to pull out some of the edges of my own hair not too much but I don't want that you know barbershop cut and I might have put the um the straps too tight in the back I think I might have put the straps too tight in the back. Kind of give her like a side part. Look at that part. That's good for a synthetic wig. That part is good for a synthetic wig. For real. What I'm going to do since I didn't flat iron my sides down, is take like some good pomade gel, hair glaze, what have you, 
Before I do that, I'm just going to use some of my Carol's Daughter Healthy Hair Butter just for like the edges of my own hair. And I only take a little bit of it. It smells good, but it's, it works good. And that's just to protect my hair. All right, ladies, so, all finished. This is Amber by the R&B Collection. Now, first of all, I'm feeling a synthetic wig. Um, I like them all, you know what I mean? Human, synthetic, what have you. I like all the kind of hair textures because I'm versatile. And just because you like human or have money to burn, you don't have to, you know, knock them synthetic wigs. Because synthetic wigs will last. You don't really have to get up and do much to them, you know. Just throw it on. You don't have to hot curl it. You don't gotta wash, well, you gotta wash it if you really want to keep the wig. But, you know what I mean? You don't have to do too much. So, memory. Synthetic wigs hold memory curl. Basically, they don't lose the style. So this one, feeling the parting. Look at this. Alright, ladies. That is... I didn't do that part. Well, I just pulled it apart. But look at it. If you really want to get up close on my head, and that's my stocking cap underneath, then you will probably think that, you know, it's either a good weave or who knows. But you can see parting like throughout the whole front. And it may not be straight because I didn't part it, you know. I just let it fall however it wanted to fall, which is fine by me. You know what I mean? Because if I really wanted to, I could just toss it or what have you. But I like the fact that it's layered. It's a very nice cut. It's layered. It's a layered style. So like I said, this is good for those who have to go to work and don't want something that is just too over dramatic or too glamorous for work because you just want something subtle. But this hairstyle is like, yeah, I just came from the hair salon, so... Mm. I like her though. I like her. I did a little tuck behind the ear thing because I wanted to see how the edges would look of my own. I'll just help give it a little bit more natural appearance than it all flowing in my face. That way if I have it behind the ear, it may be more believable that, okay, that's not a wig. Either she got some good hair or she got a banging weave job. And either way, whatever you want to think is perfectly fine as long as I know I don't walk out the house looking a hot mess. So this is Amber, and I'm going to be honest, Amber looked a little bit different on the website. She was styled different on the model. So, you know, the picture wasn't with the package, but what from what I've seen on the model, she was an okay look, but much prettier in person, much, much prettier in person. I'm feeling the front swoop and the layer look. You know, and you can also, you know, part of more on the side if you like your whole entire eye to be covered. Me personally, I need to see. So I don't really care for my my eyes to be covered up too much. Maybe a little bit, but after a while it'll dry me. So make sure that you take out a little bit of your hair on the edges, your own edges, what have you. Use some good hair gel. Um, I suggest getting Carol's Daughter Healthy Hair Butter. It's really, really good for your hair. They have the whole collection at Sephora. You can get that. I love this stuff. And it smells really, really good. Um, it has like a natural smell. Kind of like wood and stuff. Just a really, really nice smell. Like, kind of like sandalwood or what have you. But it really smells good. But, Amber, yes. Check out eclassyfashion.com and I do really believe that that sale is still going on. So September is still here. It is only the 16th. So if the sale is still going on, get in where you fit in and cash them bucks in and get yourself a nice synthetic lace front wig or human hair lace front wig. You can save some money. Um, the R&B collection is a hot collection. They give you a nice decent amount of parting, not like one inch, you know. Two inches is good. If you can work with two inches, then work it, Divas, work it. And especially being that the hair is not real dense in the front, you know what I mean? So that makes it a lot more easier to maneuver. But I'm feeling her. And look, I could just like peek up the top right here and you'll still see. Look at that. Look at that, ladies. Okay, you see that part? You wouldn't even think this is a lace front. Not a synthetic lace front anyway. You know, and I try to cover my edges really, really good. Um, what I did with this one, because I found the lace to be a little bit shiny, is I just took my kabuki brush because I had a little bit of pressed powder left on it. And I just dabbed it on the lace. That way, it's not all shiny. 
So that's another way you can dull down the lace. And as for the hair, because it's synthetic and you want to dull it down, well, get yourself some good cornstarch. Pure cornstarch, you can get it in a box for like a dollar at Walmart, or basically in the cooking aisle, baking good aisles. Rub a little bit, a little bit at a time on your hands, and just rub your fingers through the hair, and it'll dull up the shine down. Because if you don't, over time, it will, the hair will get a little bit more duller. But, you know, it's fresh out the pack, so, you know. I like this one, though. So I'm going to rock her out. I'm going to go get my baby from school. And, you know what? Let me know what you think. Check out eclassyfashion.com as well as their sister site, Lace Wig Hair Mall. And if you're in the Decatur, Georgia area, then check them out in person. I will post all the information below. And hopefully the sale is still going on and you can get in. So on that note, stay tuned and be delicious. Enjoy your weekend. And I'll be back.